Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Milk Inside a Bag of Milk Inside a Bag of Milk. A psychological horror visual novel where you must help this girl buy a bag of milk and hopefully not disappoint her. Okay. Not down your name. Manly. I'm on my way to the store, rehearsing the speech. I haven't been out for so long that I've forgotten what words they say when they enter the store. I'm on my way to the store. Hmm. Who are you talking to? I imagine being a game character. Whatever helps to gather my thoughts. What game? Well, you know. There are games in which you can see characters' thoughts. Right on the screen, you know. So I thought, if someone reads my thoughts, then I have to be really concentrated so as not to whip up the extra. Haha. <laughs> Whip up the extra. I'm deeply breathing in. Hello. Can I? Damn. I forgot. Nineteenth attempt. And I'm failing again. I bite my lips over annoyance. So once again. Hello. Can I get it? Wow, a whole word more. Thank you. I'm trying really hard. In my opinion, this time the L sound was longer than usual. Do you think this is it? Who knows? H hello Can I? Uh, I better keep my lips sealed. Don't worry. Okay. And by the way, you have been walking with your left foot on asphalt and your right foot on grass for a whole minute. W what? My right leg froze in the air. How much? 50 steps on the asphalt, and 51 on the grass. You will have to cancel the previous step. <laughs> how do you imagine it? This is not the first time. You were taught how to do it, come on. I... I don't remember. I'm going to burst into tears. Ah, uh, from the beginning. So, step one. Take a step back to get your foot exactly into your own trail. Wait, 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 how is it step one? What then? So it's already the 52nd, but wait, if I'm going backwards, then 50th, it still doesn't make a lot of sense. Okay, okay, step 50th, take a step back to get your foot exactly in your trail. Could you paraphrase at least a little? You can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't talk like that. You're hopeless. You make it sound like it's my fault. The store closes in an hour, so... You will be very, very guilty if you do not buy milk. Damn, really? So, are you ready to buy milk? Yes, yes! I gently change the position of my leg, peering carefully into the thick grass. When I entered the store, I asked the very first person I met. Hello, can I- You are a thing with four eyes. That's okay. I ain't judging. Oh. Excuse me, what? 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 Oh. You better not to do it. He's clearly not going to change his lines. You're in the risk of falling into an endless loop. Excuse me, what? What do we say about the endless loop? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. What? Oh. What is he trying to tell you? Maybe he's trying to tell you O. Oh. He's trying to scare me, but how does he know that I'm terrified by the letter O? Oh? What is so terrible about it? I have a frightening image as soon as I imagine it. I can show. Explaining won't be enough, but keep in mind. Oh, I see. Something like that. So I'll just keep on ignoring his question. So O's make you think of... The Void? What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. 
I gave her all the will into a fist. Oh? Oh. Oh man, we just got the O achievement. My interlocutor has shook and crawled. We just repeat after him. And it worked. Do more often. Wait, I said he crawled, but did he really crawl? Because I didn't even look in his direction. When exactly did you say that? Yeah, just now. Personally, I did not hear. I'm just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. I can already tell you now, I, I feel like I already know where this storyline is going. Um, I, I could be wrong, maybe we'll see. But it seems like it has to do with... On the surface, it, I think it's got more layers than that, but it looks like at the surface it may have to do with, um... Anxiety. That's why it's called Bag of Milk, because like, you're... That in itself is a challenge for this person to go and do, like a simple thing. And maybe this is like their thought process, trying to do it. And how they kind of visualize the world. I'm standing by the shelves. On the shelves there are bags of milk. The two of us are standing. And milk lies? Or maybe. Hey, hey, slow down. Do you remember why you came? To buy milk. So buy. Right here? How in your opinion should I reply? Hmm. I suppose something like, not here. Not here to take the bag and go to the cash stand. I think this does have... Fair thing. I think it has multiple endings, but I think it only has one actual ending. But I think it has, like, game overs or something if you choose the wrong answers. You're getting my nerves. I'm assuming this is the bad one. Not here. Take the bag and go to the cash desk. I guess the first sentence. And you like, for spite, like for spite, did make a pause for the second one. Wanna take away all my small victories? I sigh and pull my hand to take milk. Or rather, a bag of milk inside. In Canada, milk comes in bags. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk. Or rather, a bag of milk in in inside a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside. Reception, reception! Fifteen minutes before the store closing, hurry up! I remember what these games are called visual novels. And by the way, the numbers are written there in the full in letters. Our visual novels are worse than books. But offers are not lazy there, and you don't be lazy too. Wait. I thought only your fonts were visible on the screen. Not anymore. So watch your language. <laughs> uh -huh. Anyway, you heard me. Hurry up or there'll be no good at home. Already running. I don't think it's just anxiety. I think there's some other things in there too. But it's this whole game seems like it's a... Interesting experience, to say the least. Hello, can I get milk, please? Boy, everyone is, uh... Yeah. You have it. Ah, uh, give. I put out a weighty bag at the pay desk. Of course, not just a bag, but milk, too. Hello, can... Can I get it back, please? No. Please? No. But please, mumble throw me out of the window if I get back without milk. No. But why not? Give more. More milk? I don't have anything else. Hey. What? Pay for the milk. Huh, really? What would I do without you? I pull a crumpled cash out of my pocket and give it to the cashier. He starts to carefully examine it. About two days have passed before he had nodded satisfactorily, but a cash in the machine. Thank you. Goodbye. I'm walking down a familiar street past a gas station. A bag of milk unpleasantly pulls away my hand, reminding me of the times I took physical therapy. By the way, they gave me a bag at the pay machine, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk inside another bag. Don't get me wrong, I just like the pyramidal structure of verbal constructions. A gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Thanks for your interest. I feel like a mob ice cream. Usually I intermix bad ends into my playthrough. Um, I will go back to see some, what some of the bad responses do. But right now I don't have the heart to do it. <laughs> I feel like I, I should get at least a good ending first. Or at least try to. What's that supposed to mean? As if I tell you. But I'm really interested. 
Well, look. The ratio of water to milk and the volume of air occupied me is about the 30 to 1. I agree, it's not the tastiest ice cream. Unless you want to drink more than they eat. So the way from the store to the gas station is a stick, and the way from the gas station to home is ice cream. For today's walk, my body will be in every part of this way. Simple maths. Okay. I feel movement under my feet. Asphalt grains, petrol stains. I'm trying to keep my balance, and how do people move on something as uneven as the urban plain? Neat, heel, sock. I count every meter of the way I've gone. I even close my eyes for more concentration. Hey, watch out. Hey, watch out! Huh? Unconsciously take a sharp step aside. At the same moment, a huge bear sweeps past me, but what the? A wild ripple. Hey, I'm walking here. I'm throwing a stumbling peek at the rapidly moving animal. Its red eyes in turn look at me with mockery. Did you see that? How brazen. It was a truck. Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there bears with eyes on the back of their head? Yeah. Four eye bears. They exist. You might have died. Come on, are you saying someone will seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? The world is cruel and dangerous. I'm not in the world you're talking about. My path continues. If you think about it, the way from the store has one interesting property, in the most bizarre ways that adjust to me. When I hurry, all the traffic lights are ser servicefully extinguished. When I want to cry, a cloud appears and pours rain flows that hide my tears. Right now, I feel how the cloud is slowly gathering over my top. I'm sad. Are you sure all this is really happening? And how else? Should I... which is the... I don't know. I'll go with the top one. Have you never been visited by the idea that you all this is only in your head? The instructions do not say that at all. Apparently, these pills don't work on me either. Pills have nothing to do with it. Please, I just want to go home and go to bed. I am really, really grateful to you, but please, no more. You must accept the truth. No. You must accept the truth. No. You must. No. Yes. No! Looks like Manly doesn't help me at all. I think I just got a bad ending. I guess I'll try something else next time. Again? I hope we can do it this time. How about I just hit dot dot dot? You know what? What? Since I am a character in a visual novel, I want to talk to whoever is reading it right now. How you doing? This is as you say. I squeeze my head with the hands instead of thought block. With the edge of my eye, I notice a small bench. A great place for cliched mo visual novel monologues. I'm getting closer, putting a noticeably heavy bag of milk nearby and raising my head to the sky. There is a thing in the sky. Listen. I'm a little embarrassed. Ha! <laughs> I understand I'm going crazy. Drugs are working less and less effectively, so... Ultimately, things will happen painlessly, I hope. Do you know what I'm talking about? Ooh, I can type. Just say yes. Really? I must be quite unlike an exemplary protagonist, right? To be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Sometimes I regret it, because now I need a lot of effort just to distinguish letters and words. By the way, if you don't mind, I wouldn't like to say my diagnosis. Let at least you be the one who sees me as I am. Eva made you up. Don't take it away from me, okay? Don't ask me about too much. How stupid is all this? From the very beginning, you followed me, read my delusional thoughts, and heard my stupid conversations. Maybe I seem crazy and weird to you. Huh. What is it like to see the world with my eyes? Ever since uh, something happened, I only see red everywhere. No, don't worry about me. I've been used to it for a long time. To be honest, I even forgot whatever colors look like. Let it go. Huh. Those monsters from the store, they didn't scare me at all, because I know they won't hurt me. Sometimes I think they're the ones who are scared. Can you imagine it? By the way, if you ask, want to ask me what happened, please don't. Do you promise? Yes. Really? Do you promise? Yes. Really? 
I promise. I'm serious. Of course you couldn't not to ask. In the end, I'm just talking to myself. Sooner or later, I would have raised this topic. So you're really wondering what happened to me? Huh? I won't take time. What do you see? Hmm. I have to get like, dig really deep in interpretations here. I'm still not quite sure. Don't know. I think maybe there's an arm there? Are you sure? One way or another. This is my dad. Some of his parts at least. Okay, I was right. We do have a very difficult family. But despite all the problems, I would never have fought. Sorry, I shouldn't have raised my voice. In general, he threw himself out of the window and died. Oh, crap. This is my last memory, then a long gap. Strange, very strange. Today is the first time I've been able to buy something from a store without a serious incident. Of course, the medicine helped me, however, I think it's more of your merit. I was faking all time. Do not screw up in front of the reader. Or, oh my god, what will he think? Ah. I don't know why I decided to become a character in a visual novel for the sake of going to a store today, but it has clearly borne fruit. Thank you. By the way, I think there are some frameworks in our communication. Like what? That's how I like it. Ah. Oh, you took the frame out, literally. And yet, I'm so sad lately. I think more and more about what my life has become ever since Dad. Well, you understand. Day after day is the same. I've tried so many pills that I can't feel a difference between them anymore. As long as they keep me on my feet, I'm happy. <laughs> but you know what? Today is a special day because I have you. I want to tell you so much you can't... It was very... What? It was very rude of you. Oh no. I will not press you. I just advise you to go home. I understand. Well, dear reader, let's go. I guess time's up. We gotta get bring back the milk. Okay, I recognize this photo, actually, of this building. I stop on my floor and hang by the railing. Repeating this action every day, like a ritual, I stop being afraid of heights. A few minutes ago, the pills finally came to naught, so I'm just enjoying blissful silence. When I'm under the influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasant melodies sound in my head. Mixing with the sounds of the world around me, they create a terrible dissonance in my head. I turn around and go to my apartment. <laughs> Did you bring milk? Hi, Mom. Did you bring milk? Yes, Mom. Did your new medicine help? Yes, Mom. Go to bed. Yes, Mom. Oh, that's the end. We, 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 we bought milk. So that's it for milk bag in a bag of milk. I kind of like mentioned it briefly earlier, but it looks like this game is a whole kind of... The horror is not so much a outright monster or jump scare. The horror is the uh, sense... It's not literal horror, as in like, oh, there's blood everywhere, blah, blah, blah. Um, and like Silent Hill kind of things where those like imagining worlds and stuff like that. It's more of this person's trying to essentially just literally live their life. And you're seeing things through their eyes and their mental scape. And how they're trying to cope with it. And how even just buying a bag of milk in a sense is extremely difficult for them. And how their thoughts can like trail off. Or how their thoughts can, in a sense... It, we're, we the player are the thoughts. Um, but there is like an actual... like it, It's supposed to be their thoughts. It's not like a metagame. But it, it shows how like it can... At any moment it can kind of turn against them. And start insulting them and stuff, and then you get a bad ending. Then you never buy the bag of milk, 
because I'm assuming you just go back home because you've kind of defeated yourself mentally in a sense. So, a fairly interesting, like I said this earlier, like it's a it's really interesting psychological game. And it's psychological in a literal sense, not in a, once again, horror sense, even if it is a psychological horror game. This is a very literal psychological game, and I don't think I've really seen someone try to write a story like this. There's been some movies and stuff like that. I mean, maybe some novels, but not like a visual novel or a game. So, it's interesting from a writing standpoint. Uh, from a game standpoint, obviously, you can't really comment too much about that. It's very much a non-game, even by visual novel standards. But like I said, as an artistic written expression, it's it's interesting. I'm not using interesting in like a sarcastic or like derogatory tone. Like I, I'm literally using it as you would define it. Like it's interesting. It's, it's a little pretty interesting. Anyway, so thank you all for watching. Play milk bag in a bag of milk. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.